Hello and welcome to the beautiful city of Marseille. The second most populous city in France and the capital of the Bouches du Rhône region. Marseille is the most important trading center of this region. But with its historic and cultural landmarks, it has also become a popular hub for leisure and tourism. During this tour, we're going to find out why. We begin in the second district of Marseille. In front of us, you can see the Cathedrale de la Major. The new cathedral was built over an older church about 129 years ago, which makes this the site of the first church and the last cathedral built in France. Many people pass by the Cathedrale de la Major every day, either to visit or simply sit on the magnificent sea view square that surrounds it. Inside the cathedral, you can admire the unique blend of Byzantine and Roman architecture and gaze upon different statues and mosaics. In the main hall, seven statues represent Jesus, surrounded by six of his apostles and disciples, including Mary Magdalene and Lazarus. The cathedral lies in the Le Panier district, known as the Artist District and one of the oldest parts of Marseille. The word panier means basket in French. In the district of Le Panier, almost every wall is covered in extraordinary art, making the whole district feel like an open-air museum. And with its narrow alleys, tiny shops and colourful buildings, you will be transported by the magic of the place. Continuing on, we move to one of the most visited monuments in Marseille. Fort Saint-Jean, which is connected to Le Panier by a footbridge. This place is a testament to the military history of the city. It was first built as a commandery during the Crusades and served as the starting point for the troops to reach the Holy Land of Jerusalem. The fort of Saint-Jean's different structures, including a rise for cannons, remains of a church and vaulted passageways, are remnants of the time it was created in. North of the fort lies the Museum of European and Mediterranean Civilizations, or MUSEM in short. It is the first French national museum to be located outside Paris. With its square-shaped metal latticework, the museum perfectly contrasts the rest of the historic district. Inside, there are artefacts dedicated to Mediterranean civilizations that surround the country. The museum's collections are preserved at the Belle de Mai in the Conservation and Resource Center. There's also an auditorium to host shows, concerts and cinemas, as well as a bookshop and a panoramic restaurant. Next, we visit what's probably the most well-known part of the city, the Old Port. <laughs> 